Hello everyone and welcome to day four of building a mini library. I am starting the furniture assembly and I am so excited for this. So basically I am getting all the furniture that I have already built and I'm going to be adding the books onto the shelves, adding decorations onto the shelves, and making it look like an actual mini library because most of the other episodes were just building stuff. So now we're at like the last stretch and now we're going to put everything together and I'm very excited about it. So now we're just gonna put books onto the shelves and I tested it before. They don't need to be glued because they fit so snugly I don't think they would move around. If anything I would have to glue down these books because they are pretty tiny and they could probably move around if I move around this shelf. So let's just get to building. I'm gonna start with this shelf and put the books behind it. So it seems like we need these books to go behind the shelf and they fit perfectly. And then we need, do I have it? These books. This one might need to be glued down because it doesn't fit snugly. And it looks like that. Can you see it? There's like a glare. And then we need, do I have it? So I think, you can't see. They want some books stacked beside it. So I'm just gonna do what I'm gonna do. And you'll just see it. This is like a puzzle to fit all these books in. The rightful place. Awesome. Now we have, now we have this shelf done, pardon the reflection. Now I'm going, oh my god, I just realized I never put shelves here. Hold on. It took me until like now to realize that. I was wondering why I had these left over. Oh my god. Wow. Let's do that really quickly. I can't believe I forgot that. So we won't do these shelves until they dry. So we'll do the other shelves in the meantime. On the top they have this, and then they have a book on top of it. Their library is a little bit like messier than what I would want my library to be. So I'm gonna make mine a tad neater. They want this one here. But then they want me to put a painting over the Van Gogh book cover, and I'm not a fan of that. So I think I'm gonna put the painting here. Yeah, I'm not covering Van Gogh. Sorry, but that's just not allowed. So I guess we could put, or what if I just put, ugh, oh, I'll put it here. Let's get this glue out and glue it. Here, I'm not covering the Van Gogh one. We are not covering Van Gogh in this house. Press this down, and then they want it to say software on the top, but I think that's kind of silly because we have Van Gogh up there, so I'm putting art. I'm going to continue decorating and stop talking because I feel like I'm just like wasting time. Now we are going to do this yellow shelf and I have everything set up so I don't have to spend time actually looking for it. I think that should be good. For now we'll do it like this so it doesn't slide back. Thank you. 
there we go. So we have some pictures on the side of the shelf. We have the portrait and my little vase that I made. And then this is the bookshelf. Cute! Now I'm going to decorate this little yellow shelf. We got our leather suitcase. I don't know why they made me put stickers on this side if I'm gonna glue it down. It's almost done, but I just have to put some papers right here. And then it's done. So now we're going to start with the red shelf. I have all my supplies right here, and then we're gonna start building. There we go. The red shelf is done. And now we move on to this shelf. There we go, it's done. Adorable. Now, all we have to do is glue a book onto this ladder. They want it to stay opened, but I don't think mine can, so I'm just gonna glue it on to the ladder. And that's all you have to do for the ladder. As for this end table, they want me to glue down a frame, but I don't have any more frames to glue down. So I think I'm just gonna glue a picture frame like this. Or you know what? I'll just glue down a book. We're changing it up. We're changing how we decorate our mini library. Cause I don't need to follow the instructions completely. So I just glued a book onto the top of it. I think that's cute. And now our dreaded chair. All we have to do is glue a few books onto it. For our mini basket, we have to add a couple of books and a box to it, but I think I'm just gonna keep on putting more books until it's like filled. I think that's cute. And 
And then lastly, we have to make a book stack along with a book stack here. I forgot to do that. So we're gonna glue this and this to create a pile. Let's do this first. I don't know how this is gonna stay down. Hopefully it will. Then we just have to glue a few books onto that. And one more book. And then we have a book stack. As for the box book stack, we have a paper box. Then we have four books to glue down haphazardly. I'm gonna do it by size. These last two are the same size. This is very delicate. Can you see this? Can you see this book stack? Can you appreciate it? It's so tiny, I don't know if you could see it. Anyway, so that is all the furniture assembly. And I have a lot of leftover books to just have around, so I'm gonna keep them in case I need to add them anywhere. But the next step is actually doing the lighting. And I don't think I'm gonna do this on screen because it seems really complicated, so I'm just gonna do the lighting off screen with my brother's help or my mom's help and then i will come back to you and we will be putting all of the library together and it'll be really cute and adorable and i think it's going to be a grand old time so i'm going to be doing the lighting off camera but i hope you enjoyed seeing me assemble all of this furniture it was such a peaceful adorable time and i love how everything came out i changed it a little but next you will see the whole entire assembly of my mini library and then this series will be done i can't believe it it's taken me so many days to do this but it was also a really fun time so i hope you enjoyed this series if you have not seen any episodes previously be sure to check that out because i've gone through so many strifes and struggles to get to this point but i hope you enjoyed this episode and i hope you have a wonderful day bye